Herzlich willkommen everyone, welcome back to the channel. I hope you're having a fantastic day. Let's for once cut through the waffle and jump straight into it. In Premiere Pro, you can easily apply effects to all snippets and clips that you've created from the same source file you've imported simply by applying the effects inside the source tab within your effect controls panel. Unfortunately, that doesn't work with audio effects. Why Adobe, why? Fortunately, there's a simple workaround that, while not quite the same, allows you to apply audio effects to all of the clips on the same audio track. So then all you have to do is keep your audio tracks organized and you're golden. In order to do that, pop open the audio track mixer, which you'll find inside the window menu. The audio track mixer contains controls for all of the audio tracks within your currently open sequence, plus a mix channel for the final audio. In the top left hand corner, pretty well hidden, thanks Adobe, you can expand the audio track mixer to show your instant and send effects. Now I won't go into the difference between instant and send effects, at least not in this video. To keep it simple, just stay within the upper part of this section so you're only using instant effects. And you can now simply use these drop down menus to select any audio effect and that effect will get applied to all of the audio clips that sit within that particular audio track. You can double click on the effect to tweak its settings and with the effect selected, at the bottom of that section you'll find a little dial that allows you to tweak how strongly that effect influences the final audio on the audio track, plus a simple switch to just turn it on or off. And if you want to apply audio effects to all of the audio clips within your sequence, simply apply those effects to the mix track within the audio track mixer. Now there's a ton of cool stuff that you can do with audio within Premiere Pro, including using send effects, which I haven't really touched on. But if you like this video, give it a like, subscribe for more tips and tutorials on Premiere Pro, After Effects, Blender and video post-production. And let me know what you would like to see next down in the comment section below. And with that, thank you very much for watching and until next time, I will see you later.